making a three pound base. That thing's gonna be a monster. It's a lot of clay, buddy. It's gonna be big. You're not gonna wanna cut it in half when you're done. Yeah, well. <laughs> The basic process for creating a picture begins like most other projects. You begin by centering the clay, opening the clay, pulling up the walls. And when the walls are pulled up, notice that Steve uses several different um, times of pulling up to belly out the bottom of that pitcher. This will give it more volume so that you can put whatever liquid in it that you want. and by taking several times to do it, he's making sure that the walls are thick enough to handle it. He's not pushing the clay too much all at one time. Once the pitcher has the basic shape that we're looking for, Steve is trimming the bottom just to make the clay a little thin. This will make it so that it dries evenly. And then he's actually going to grab a rib tool and clean this up a little bit so that there's less work to do while trimming. The final step is to create a spout. Notice how Steve is going to use three fingers, his thumb, index finger, and middle finger to create the spout. The thumb and middle finger are on the outside, the index finger is on the inside, and he squeezes them together to make the spout. You know, I might keep that one. I told you that would happen. <laughs> I think Amy would like that. I told you, I said once you get a nice three pound picture going on. Now that this pitcher is thrown, it's ready to get trimmed, then we'll add a handle, bisque fire it, glaze it, and fire it again. I hope that video was helpful for you. Have a wonderful day.